먼저 지난 시간 복습입니다. Sky is clearing. Three is May. Sky is clearing. Three is May. Sky is clearing. Three is May. 바람 좀 쐬러 갈까요? Shall we get some air? Shall we get some air? The sky is clearing. Shall we get some air? 영화 미피 포유 아홉 번째 시간입니다. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. But you don't run with him. I'm not exactly built for it. TV도 보고 패트릭이 뛰는 것도 구경한다는 루이자. 패트릭과 같이 뛰지는 않는다고 하네요. 비 빌트포는 무엇을 위해 건설되다라는 표현입니다. 따라서 나는 이것을 위해 건설되지 않았다. 운동을 위해 건설되지 않았다. 즉 운동이 체질에 맞지 않다고 의역할 수 있습니다. Be built for. Be built for. I'm not exactly built for it. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Wow. Your life's even duller than mine. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Wow. Your life's even duller than mine. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Wow. Your life's even duller than mine. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Wow. Your life's even duller than mine. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Wow. Your life's even duller than mine. I don't do much. Okay? I go to work and I go home and that's it. Your life's even duller than mine. 별거 없는 평범한 일상을 보내는 루이자. 윌은 루이자가 자신보다 더 따분한 인생을 살고 있다고 말합니다. 덜. 덜은 따분하거나 재미없음을 의미합니다. 당신의 인생이 나의 인생보다 더 따분하다. Dull. Dull. Your life's even duller than mine. He's in a good mood. Like it's a long time since he's laughed at anything. He's in a good mood. Like it's a long time since he's laughed at anything. He's in a good mood. Like it's a long time since he's laughed at anything. He's in a good mood. Like it's a long time since he's laughed at anything. He's in a good mood. Like it's a long time since he's laughed at anything. He's in a good mood. It's a long time since he's laughed at anything. 윌이 기분이 좋아 보인다고 말하는 네이선. 네이선도 윌이 웃는 걸 정말 오랜만에 보는 듯합니다. 이게 다 루이자 덕분일까요? 모두 잡는다고들 하죠. 모두는 분위기나 기분을 뜻합니다. 그는 기분이 좋다. Mood, mood. He's in a good mood. He has a checkup every six months. To see if he's getting better. He has a checkup every six months. To see if he's getting better. He has a checkup every six months. To see if he's getting better. He has a checkup every six months. To see if he's getting better. He has a checkup every six months. To see if he's getting better. He has a checkup every six months to see if he's getting better. 윌이 다니는 병원에 함께 오게 된 루이자. 윌은 6개월마다 검진을 받기 위해 병원을 방문합니다. 체크업. 체크업은 말 그대로 몸 상태를 체크하는 것으로 진단이나 검진을 의미합니다. Checkup. Checkup. He has a checkup every six months. Yeah, that's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. Yeah, that's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. Yeah, that's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. Yeah, that's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. Yeah, that's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. Yeah. That's to stop his muscles atrophying. Will's body no longer works below here. 윌은 척수가 다쳐서 상태가 나아질 수는 없다고 말하는 네이선. 루이자는 그동안 네이선과 윌이 함께 재활 운동을 했으니까 윌의 몸 상태도 회복될 수 있다고 생각했었나 봅니다. 에트로피. 에트로피는 의학 용어로 신체 일부가 위축되다라는 뜻을 가지고 있습니다. Atrophy. Atrophy. That's to stop his muscles atrophying. 노론거. 노론거는 더 이상 뭐뭐가 아니다라는 표현입니다. 
또한 워크는 작동하다라는 뜻을 가지고 있죠. 여기서는 몸이 작동을 하는 것, 즉 몸이 제 기능을 하는 것을 의미합니다. 따라서 이 문장은 여기 아래로는 더 이상 몸이 제 기능을 하지 않는다. 즉 몸이 마비가 되었음을 의미하게 됩니다. No longer, no longer. Will's body no longer works below here. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? Oh, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? Oh, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? Oh, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? Oh, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? Oh, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But there's medical advances taking place all the time, right? But no one's worked out how to fix spinal cord yet. 네이선의 말을 듣고도 계속해서 미래 회복 가능성에 대해 확인 받고 싶어하는 루이자. 아직까지 척수 손상을 치료할 의학 기술이 존재하지 않는다고 하네요. 워크아웃. 워크아웃은 운동하다라는 뜻을 가지고 있습니다. 집중이 안될 때는 잠깐 운동하고 나서 공부를 하면 문제가 잘 풀리기도 하죠. 워크아웃은 또한 무언가를 해결하거나 해결 방법 등을 찾을 때도 쓸수 있습니다. 해결하다 방법을 찾다. Work out. Work out. No one's worked out how to fix spinal cord yet. Louis got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. Louis got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. Louis got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. Louis got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. Louis got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. No, it's got subtitles. It gets so you don't notice after a while. 패트릭과 함께 영화관을 찾은 루이자. 윌과 함께 자막 있는 영화를 한번 재밌게 봤더니 자막 있는 영화도 볼만하다고 루이자가 말하고 있습니다. 노티스 노티스는 무언가를 알아차리다라는 뜻을 가집니다. 따라서 너는 잠시 후에 알아차리지 못한다. 즉 영화를 보다 보면 자막에 익숙해지고 자막이 크게 신경 쓰이지 않게 된다는 의미입니다. Notice, notice. It gets so you don't notice after a while. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. 눈이 펑펑 내리는 어느 날. 다시 위례 집으로 출근을 한 루이자가 위례 아버지를 마주합니다. 추워진 날씨 탓인지 위례 감기 기운이 있다고 하네요. 여러분은 칠칠 맞게 감기에 걸리면 안 되겠죠? 칠, 칠은 추위나 냉기 오한을 뜻하는데요. 위례에 약간의 오한이 있다. 즉 위례 약간 감기 기운이 있다는 것으로 해석할 수 있습니다. Chill, chill. He's not great. Bit of a chill. I'm on my mobile if you need me. 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 오늘은 다들 외출하고 없어서 잠시 동안 루이자가 혼자 위를 돌봐야 한다고 하네요. 모블 또는 모바일은 이동할 수 있음을 의미하며 여기서처럼 휴대폰을 의미하기도 합니다. 따라서 아이몬 모바일. 이는 휴대폰을 켜놓고 있다 혹은 사용하고 있다라는 뜻이 되므로 휴대폰 켜놓을 테니 필요하면 전화하라는 표현이 됩니다. Mobile, mobile. I'm on my mobile if you need me. Um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head. On my neck and just lift gently. Um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head. On my neck and just lift gently. Um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head. On my neck and just lift gently. Um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head. On my neck and just lift gently. Um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head. On my neck and just lift gently. What do I do? Put your hand under my head, on my neck, and just lift gently. 상태가 좋지 않아 보이는 윌. 루이자가 뭐 필요한 거 없냐고 묻자. 윌은 베개가 불편하다고 이야기합니다. 리프트. 
리프트는 동사로는 무언가를 들어올리다라는 뜻이며 명사로는 승강기를 의미합니다. 우리는 보통 엘리베이터라고 하죠. 이는 미국에서 주로 쓰이는 표현이며 주로 영국에서는 이를 리프트라고 표현합니다. Lift, lift, put your hand under my head, on my neck, and just lift gently. 상태가 좋아 보이지 않는 윌. 과연 루이자가 혼자서 윌을 잘 케어할 수 있을까요? 마무리 시간입니다. 먼저 자막 없이 들어본 후 자막과 함께 다시 한번 점검해 보세요. But this medical advance is taking place all the time, right? Oh, well, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But this medical advance is taking place all the time, right? Oh, well, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. But this medical advance is taking place all the time, right? Oh, well, yeah. But no one's worked out how to fix a spinal cord yet. Lou, it's got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. <laughs> Lou, it's got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. <laughs> Lou, it's got subtitles. I guess you don't know it's after a while. <laughs> Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. Is he okay? He's not great. Bit of a chill. I'm on my mobile if you need me. Okay. I'm on my mobile if you need me. I'm on my mobile if you need me. Okay. And um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head, on my neck, and just lift gently. And um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head, on my neck, and just lift gently. And um, what do I do? Put your hand under my head, on my neck, and just lift gently. 오늘의 영상이 도움이 되셨나요? 도움이 되셨다면 구독과 좋아요 꼭 눌러주시고 관심의 댓글도 남겨주세요. 이상 시선이었습니다. 사랑합니다.